Hey, 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 what's up, beautiful people? Welcome back to the Be Official Podcast. I'm your host, Paul Payne 37 and yeah, it's so funny how we've been running now for for a year now, yeah. For a year now. This is like our last episode for 2022, you know. I just want to say thank you to each and everybody, each and everyone who's been supporting us through the course of the year and i'm so super super humbled for your love and support you guys have been amazing and awesome you guys are the superstars the officials you know just like we say it you know for, uh, it's it's been an overwhelming year and uh yeah a lot of goods you know and uh a lot of uh, stuff to reflect on you know and this is something that is very 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 humbling to uh just look you know, back and uh, reminisce and just be grateful for, for the gift of life God has given us, you know. So thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, Merry, happy, can I say happy holidays or Merry Christmas in advance, you know. Merry Christmas in advance, happy festive season, happy new year in advance, you know. Uh, I pray that you guys go into the new year with the, with the, with the mindset that is just focused, you know, and removing each and every negative thought, you know, each and everything that uh, anybody's telling you about what you can do, blah, 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 all this kind of stuff, you know. So please, I want you to go in, locked in, you know, full pronto with, uh, with the mind of an ego, you know. And this brings me to the song we are breaking down today titled uh bad energy yes to, uh, yeah it's a song we released this month yeah that's what i'm saying this is like our last episode of 2022 and i'm just super grateful for all of you you know you guys have been really amazing so uh without further ado i think let's dive in and uh kick in so the concept behind bad energy eh? um when when the song was re- like when I had the concept of the song, eh, it was this was something that uh, I had self doubts if I can put it that way on how people are gonna receive it, you know, because regarding your own space, sometimes uh, people can tend to flock on you and say you are now, you know. Uh, quote unquote, somebody who's raising up their wings and stuff, you know, probably you now uh, boasting and all that kind of stuff, you know, but in the actual sense, you're just getting your own energy, you know, with how things are moving right now, it's very difficult to be in a space where you are focused and locked in on yourself, you know. So bad energy just simply reflects on you guarding your own energy and not condoning or uh, letting just people flock into your space, you know, and wreck it off and just go out. Because by the end of the day, you alone are left to rebuild back and just, you know, like position yourself again back to who you were meant to be, you know. So... I think the the whole idea, I met a friend, you know, and we started talking and, you know, he started asking me some questions and stuff. Yeah. And they're like, ah, but you don't call, you know, you don't do this, you don't do that, you know. So I was like, ah, but if I don't call or text, are we the friends? I, I've, I've had friendships, right? I have relationships whereby we don't communicate on a daily, you know. But when we meet, it's like the energy is different, you know. And yeah, it's it's not all friendships that I will communicate on a daily, I will be with like on a daily basis, you know, like where are we keeping up with the Kardashians and stuff now, nah, but you know, where it's, uh, they, they're all different. They come on all different levels, you know, it's not everybody that you can uh, have that locked in moment, you know, every time. So yeah, I've had friends where we talk like probably after a few months, you know, when we meet up, we talk. It's it's a whole different vibe, you know. So it doesn't mean just because we don't talk on a daily and we're not friends. You mean, are we that friends if we never call? So, yeah. So I'm going to start it right now. Today, I have, uh, I have my brother's going to help me out. I didn't want to do this on my own. Today, uh, I, I, have, I have my brother's going to help me out. Shout out to Emmanuel. I see you, my brother. I see you, my brother. So, yeah. So today, we're going to start with... Uh, 
So Emmanuel is going to help me. He's going to be telling me the lines and I'll be breaking them down for you. So we can start with verse 1, my brother. All right. So in the first verse, you went on and said, ego attitude, see. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mozakatinga. Ego attitude, what? Continue, 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 my brother. Yes, you went on and said, ego attitude, see, I never learned. Yeah. I've been chilling with the ego from the motherland. Yeah. Talk all you want. I'm on cloud nine. nine. Yeah. Those, those, those lyrics just reminisce, you know. Ego attitude, see, I never learned. I've been chilling with the ego from the motherland. So, for this, right, uh... I've been chilling with the ego from the motherland. Uh, ego attitude to see a neverland. You know, having a mind of an ego, you know how an ego can haunt, right? Those things can, you know how it looks on a prey, you know, just the distance and all that, you know. So that kind of focus is the energy that I was portraying here. You feel me? Like, where well, you keep locked in. But somebody asked me, he said, uh, I think that was my sister. She, she, but you say never land. An ego lands, right? I'm like, yeah, you're right. That's why the second line says, I've been chilling with an ego from the motherland. If you check out our Zambian flag, there's an ego that never lands. You know? So, yeah, I had to marry the two. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, this, so it's, it's just me putting this, uh, like get, getting into this phase of focus and just being focused on what I want to do. All right. Next lines. Okay. Okay. And you went on to say, um, everybody is a star when they're online. Block out, block out your hater like my ex line. Block out your hate like you're my, my ex line. Uh, yeah. Right. So everybody is a star when they're online. You know, it's sad, right? The. Okay. You can go on. Maybe. Yeah. Everybody's a star when they're online. Block out your head like a like my X-line. Why you do something like that fast? Mm-hmm. Take out, take out. Ah, you're stupid. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. Everybody's a star when they're online. When they're online. Block out your, your head like, like my X-line. X-line. Uh huh. Bad energy. I never. Vaco sign. Yeah. Molo mo fulu fulu. That's a bad. That's a bad line, right? Yes. All right. So, um, block up my head like my ex line. Uh, you know how things can just tend to be intense, right? Especially when it comes to social media, where each and everybody right now who's behind a keyboard is, is a star, you know? Everybody, like, there's just this thing where this negative vibe where people just tend to flock. Like, everybody wants attention now. You feel me? Like, everybody wants to be seen. So, you'll find somebody just puts out a picture of themselves and people will initially just go out there and just look for something negative. I have been body shamed, you know, uh, to a degree whereby I don't see the negative comments, right? But it's the... These these are messages I get from people. Like let's say, they'll say no. This was somebody was saying about this, nah, this and that. But yeah, so everyone nowadays is on a verge whereby they'll do whatever, they'll insult, they'll drag you, they'll drag your name under the mat and that kind of stuff, and just drift you down to just fill up their ego or whatever that they. They are feeding, you know, their negative energy that they are feeding just for some attention. So when I say block out your head like my ex line, definitely when I see such bad hate comments, man, I block you. I block, I block, I block, I block, you know. So bad energy, that's a bad sign. So when I say I'm lomo fulu fulu, that's a bad line. I'm like, but mouthing is not just, it's something that is very common, right? Yeah. It's very common, especially when it comes to uh, just people talking down on other people, you know. And for me, I think that's the energy that I I don't love, you know. It doesn't resonate with me very well these days, to be honest. It's something that just puts me off, you know. So, yeah. On to the next one, my brother. All right, all right. Um, you went on and said, uh, you talk about me 
when you're not with me. You talk about them when you're not with them. That's sad. All right. So just like I was saying, right, but more thing, you know, people, when I'm here with them, right, the will be speaking, 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 and they'll be talk, talking about other people and stuff. Then immediately you're out of that place, right? People tend to switch up and start shooting at you, you know, but nothing on you. So I think that was those lines. I think those are just pretty straightforward. Yeah. On to Vestuma, brother. Okay. Friends telling me that I never call. Are we... Friends. Are we that friends if I never call? <laughs> that. <laughs> that's a that's a wet date. So, uh huh. That's yeah, all. Yeah, friends telling me that I never call. Uh -huh. Are we that friends if I never call? Yes. Just like I was mentioning in my like before I started the whole thing, right? Where people tend to start asking you all these questions and tell you, no, I so much more for nation, like you don't call and all that kind of stuff. But then you later on realize and say, yo, uh, just because I don't call doesn't mean we in friends. You feel me? Like, just like I mentioned, there are friends that you will meet after three months. You know, you don't talk, you don't text, don't call. But when you meet, the whole energy is different. You know, it's not everybody that you can keep up with every time to be honest with you like from I, I don't know about other people but for me it's it's draining you know so there's only a few contacts that i keep up on a daily to daily basis it's not everybody that i keep up with but when we link up the, the energy is different you know so that's like are we the friends if i never call my brother you know yeah on to the next, on to the next. All right, so we we'll move to verse two. Verse two, verse two. Come on, give it to me. So yeah, you went on and said, too fine, too fresh. They don't understand. Yes. I've been looking fresh so clean from the pond. Oh, my brother. Oh, my brother. Oh, my brother. I see you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's just me, you know, putting on the African lingo, you know, and uh, not the African lingo, but, you know, the African swag, you know, of just feeling so good. You know, yeah, just like feeling amazing and um, just letting you know that, you know, it is what it is by the end of the day. <laughs> Despite how much you talk about me, how much you slay my name, how much you put me under the mud, boy, oh boy, I'm going to come in correct. You know, I ain't stopping for nobody because there are some people whereby uh, we, we take hateful comments differently. You understand? Other people... Like, I, I, I know and understand how this feels, you know. People tend to, like, slaughter your neck to the point whereby you even feel ashamed of being yourself, you know. You, you, you're even ashamed of just looking good, you know. Just, like, slaying, looking old because you're afraid of how people are going to look at you, how people are going to say, what are they going to say, you know. I previously met uh, a female friend, right, um, a very intelligent woman, um, she, she told me something, right. That really resonated with me, you know? So she said, for me, I don't know. I take what people say personal, like it really digs inside my mental and my heart, you know, like whatever they say, I take it personal, you know? So people are different, but yeah, I, 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 I think what I told them, like, you need to rise up to that occasion because that's you letting them win. You know, and that's what people want to see. They want to see you down. They want to see you fall. They want to see you cry. Amen. Yeah. On to the next one, my brother. All right. Uh, too fine. Don't vex. They don't understand. I be. They be hating me. I'm just way too beyond. beyond. Love and hate. I'm going anyway. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I think we 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 dark our minds are. Yeah, first your dad. Since your dad, your first. Hey. Then you're no gamba. Maybe you're your dad. Okay. All right. Cool. Hit me with it. Again. Yeah. The the sec. Yeah, yeah, the. Yeah, yeah. Too fine. Don't vex. Eh. Uh huh. Eh. Uh -huh. Okay. Too fine. Don't vex. They don't understand. Yeah. They be hating me. I'm just way too beyond. Yeah, I think this is the same. This is the same thing I was saying. Uh, talking about right like whereby you don't conform to what people say you just whatever that they say my my g like just keep on going don't stop for anybody 
people always talk good bad people always talk just keep on heading keep your head high and keep on moving i think i have a story right um with how with people's opinions there's a time i, re- I released there's a song called nakana featuring dj victor shout out to victor man uh all the way from uganda my brother my brother produced by fusa shout out to fusa man so this song right talks about gender-based violence and this song wasn't the christian type of so sound or whatever that you might want to put it in so send it to a couple of different friends a lot said this is not you this is not what you are not supposed to go this way blah 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 na 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 you know i it caught me a, a, a little like i felt like holding on to the song you know but one person stood out for me and they told me Yo, this is amazing. I love the message because you're talking about things people are going through. And this is what people need to be hearing, right? And they had a point. You know, I told him about how I was like, no, put it out. At first, you're the one who's writing. How were you feeling at that moment? You know, you're the one with the message. You're the one God was talking to. So my, it's, it's put it out or never. That, that's it, you know. And I did that. That song went on to top the charts in the UK for a straight, straight whole month. You know, on Sort FM UK radio, topped four weeks on number one. That's no joke, you know. So that implies and just tells you that you need to focus on your energy, focus on uh, the path that you're on, that God has set you on. Yeah. Next line is my brother. Okay, okay. Love or hate, I'm gone anyway. Peace and love, if you know where I stay. If you know where I stay. Stick to love. A heart needs a prayer. Exactly. So, yeah, uh, love or hate, I'm going anyway, you know? Love me, hate me, I'm moving. I'll keep on moving, ain't stopping for nobody, you know? That's the energy, that's the energy, you know? Bad energy, stay far away. Uh, then, what, what's the other line? Love or hate, I'm going anyway. Peace and love, you know where to stay. Like, the only, the only thing that I want is peace and love. You feel me? Peace and love. I'll reside. Okay? I'll reside. Yeah. Okay. On to the next lines. They just want to hit. That's dark. Yeah. Let, them, them, let me light up. They just want to be, be on my toe. But I'm heads up. Toxic friends. If I see you. I break up. Am I? Am I in your name? Am I in your name? <laughs> Toxic friends. If I see you. Me, I break up. On me. Yeah. Me, I break up here. Okay. So, go, go, yeah. They just want to hit. That's dark. Let, Let me light, light up. up. They just want to be on my toe. But I'm heads up. up. Toxic friends. If I see. Me, I break up. Me, I break up. So, I think this is the type of thing, right? Where there's darkness, don't fight with darkness. You feel me? Where there's darkness, fight with light. All right? Um... Doesn't want to be on my heads, but uh, be on my toes, but I'm heads up. People will always follow you, right? They'll be following you, but they don't know what you are, where you're heading to, you see. So let them keep following you. That's all. Let them keep following you. Always keep your head up. Don't let your crown fall, because the moment you bend, that's when your crown falls. So always move with your head high, because you're a king and you're a queen. Don't let nobody step on you. Next lines. Okay. I frame my heart every day with a close up. Gratitude every day when I get up. Thank my God every day. May I turn up. Okay. So I frame my heart. So meaning I'm guiding my heart at all costs, you know. Even the Bible says that. We need to guide our hearts at all costs, man. Like you need to know what you're letting in, you know. Uh, All the things that you are filling up your heart, you need to be really very careful you know so i'm framing it very well like you're getting a close-up you know on your iphone or on your whatever phone that you're using (laughs) it is what it is Uh, or on your camera you know like right now how i'm being framed right now you know so yeah that's how closely i'm watching my heart so yeah um what was the last line uh thank my god every day 
every day waking up being grateful for the for the life god has given me you know it's that's why i say gratitude is a must always thank god man thank god there's a lot of things that are happening a lot of bad energy going around so me just getting locked in and just thanking god for the life he's given me is everything that warms my heart on to the next one my brother okay uh pat my back if i fall and i dust up Go on God because your heart needs a cleanup. He's the healer, so you better do a cleanup. Okay, so uh pat my back every time. It's not all the time people come to your aid when you fall down. You know, so there are moments when you are waiting for you fall, right? And you constantly keep on waiting for people to come and pick you up. <laughs> oh my. I'm sorry to be the sad bearer of this news, but Trust me, you are the only person who can save you. You know, if you constantly keep on waiting for people to come and save you, you will wait forever. And this is the type of thing where you you have that, uh, like, hatred towards people now because you think nobody cares about you. But everybody's going through hell, man. Everybody's going through thick and thin. And it's it's very important, like, you, you rise up, get up, you know, pat your back. I always do this to myself, you know. Always, when you get up in the morning, very important. Like, raise up, shine, and just do you, you know. Uh, so, what was the second line? Uh, second. Mm -hmm. Thank my God every day, I turn up. Mm -hmm. Pat my bag back. back. Mm -hmm. If I fall, and yeah. I just up. Okay, okay, so next lines, next lines. Okay. Go on, go, because he's the healer. Yeah, call on God. Okay, I think yeah. So there's a line. There's there's a there's a line say call on God because your heart needs a cleanup, right? So all I'm saying is that to everybody who's uh, spreading hate, man, you need Jesus in your life. Okay, I've come here, friend. You need Jesus in your life. You need uh, you need uh, you need him. For everything, you feel me? Because that's not normal. <laughs> it's not normal, my brother, my sister. You need to check yourself, you know? Yeah. All right. Let's go to the next lines, my brother. One nation, so you know we are about to blow up. Yeah. Pull up, pull up, be official. We link, link up. up. Tiri Paolino, you know we are about to pick up. Okay. So one nation. You know, we need to go in together as... One Zambia, one nation, just like my motto of my country, you know, one Zambia, one nation. So we need to work as a team. Divided we stand, eh? <laughs> united we stand, divided we fall, you know. So always, I think that's the most important. I, I think that, that that message stands very strong, you know. So let's not divide ourselves by, you know, picking sides or whatever or shooting down people. It's not healthy. Um, so, yeah, we're about to blow up. Trust me, Zambia Kuchalo. Zambia Kuchalo, yeah, Tiri Paulendo, you know about a pickup. Tiri Paulendo, you know the car, the, the service, whatever. Yeah, all I'm trying to say is we're on a journey and you know we're about to pick up, but like picking you up by an obo or something. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> on to the next one, bro. So turn down your, your head. Watch love about to step up. Yes. That's all. Tone down your hate and watch love about to step up. So yeah, tone down your hate. Don't tone, tone it down, man. Just tone it down. Tone down your hate, please. Tone down your hate. Make sure it's very low and let love step up. Love always wins, man. Love always wins. Is it, the way there's love, there's just so much joy and... You know, everything is just peaceful. Don't cause chaos, but I need you to stay far away. I've been your host. Thank you so much for having us. You know, that was bad energy. And yeah, today, shout out to my co-host, <laughs> Stroke Director, uh, Emmanuel. Uh, it's, been a, it's been a great one. It's been a, an amazing one. Last episodes of 2022. And all I can say is stay safe out there, man. Especially during the festive season. 
it's wild man it's really wild so please you guys keep it locked uh you know enjoy time with family and friends you know this this is a time to really celebrate and you know the reason for the season is yahweh all right so please uh keep it jesus you know keep it clean keep it official always and everybody who's been supporting the apparel thank you so much it's been an amazing journey we we keep on growing so for the website if you want to order for people outside zambia you can order on my website that's the reason why i created that for people outside mostly you know because of you know the shipping thing it's it's uh it's difficult from here it's wild location <laughs> Yeah, so I did it for people for outside, you know. So please, uh, if you want to order anything that you want to order from the upper hills, please go on the website www.pupenitry7.com. You know where you know what the sign is. Stay official, stay locked. Thank you so much. God bless you. Sign out.